Hello everyone, welcome to Dumber Mods. I have a very special treat for you, I think, and this is just my personal opinion because I know some of you pure old school vanilla Minecrafters may not necessarily like this, but you can probably appreciate the work that goes into this particular mod. Now, I personally think this is the best Christmas tree I've ever seen in Minecraft. Uh, and there's good reason for that and I'm gonna show you that in two shakes of a lamb's tail Which means really quick think about it. How fast is a lamb's tail move back and forth? You're not done. Oh my goodness. I'm, I'm already late. I'm already late by talking too much Let me show you how to actually make these things. So here's what's actually what the mod makes uh, When I originally looked at this mod all there was was this tree uh, The tree itself, but since coming back to it before I actually was able to show it he's updated to make it a Christmas uh, type and I'm not gonna actually bring this actually I will bring this in only for demonstration purposes so you've got three ornaments you got the normal tree and then you've got an, a tree with ornaments on it like a Christmas tree and I'll show you actually how to make these things very simple doesn't matter what leaves you use doesn't matter what wood you use and it makes the tree to make the Christmas tree you use this ornament and that and that actually makes the Christmas tree like that um, we don't actually need these things so let's put that and to make the special Christmas tree ornaments you put one of each color in there and that actually makes that special thing that we use to make the tree I don't know what it is there's no name so I just call it special the thing Mahuja the bobber and then in order to make an ornament you use there's only red green and blue right now but you know red dye makes the red one blue dye makes the blue and green etc etc you get it you know what I mean so I'm gonna show you and before I show you I'm gonna show you the the difference in case you don't know what I'm talking about in case maybe you're a little bit new to Minecraft which is okay no worries if your journey's just beginning you're going to have a blast this game is awesome sauce so here's traditionally what the flora looks like and this type of uh, texture uh, rendering or whatever for environments is actually although it's very simplified and pixelated in Minecraft is very common even in games like Battlefield or Call of Duty they make it look a little bit more detailed obviously they want more realism and the textures on, on each piece but it's this you know one side and then do it from multiple layers to give it a 3d look you know what I mean so you can see if you look at the top view you can see it's like an X there's four actual pieces and it's just duplicated around to give you that textured look to make it look like it's 3d the difference between that and this is monumentous now this is like I said it's not huge but this 3d rendering is very impressive keep in mind based on the comments I've been reading in the actual um, forums not everyone is going to be able to run this um, mod because apparently it's very it's fairly intensive on your system so if you don't have a a fairly decent system you may not actually be able to do this or you're gonna get huge frame rate issues I actually happen to be lucky enough to have a fairly decent computer that can handle this but look at this so it's not it's not even the details I'm not talking about the fact that it's like you know photo realism it's the fact that it's actually more 3d like multiple levels and looks actually 3d now if you look closely at it you know if you look at the leaves they're still thin but because of the multiple layers and how closely they're sort of put together it creates this impressive 3d uh, image of what a tree would look like versus just plain old four but remember this uses up way more resources and here's the Christmas tree with the ornaments on it I think it looks awesome I personally think that is it, it's impressive I mean this is a, a recent addition remember when I first looked at the mod all there was was that tree and now they've got the Christmas tree here think about uh, a realm although I think it would probably crash most systems an entire realm where it was filled with 3d rendered images like this playing in Minecraft some of you really like the photorealism some of you guys really like the more detailed even if it's not photorealism but cartoony even if it was like uh, BD craft or 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 any of the other one doku craft but using this detailed rendering effect would make for some incredibly impressive objects in the Minecraft world I think it shows great promise even now even after all this time that Minecraft's been out they continue to innovate they continue to create things that just make this game so much better here's a look at these ornaments close up uh, and the red one I love the red one. Oh, look at that look at the work on that that is friggin awesome and I think that's Tigger on the back there I couldn't get it to and then there's an angel oh look hello dumber you're my favorite 
Come snuggle up with me under my coat. <laughs> That's rude. That's rude, lady. I'm buried. Oh, it's not Tigger. It's a snowman. I never looked at it from that side. But very, very festive. But even these ornaments, you can see, although it's, you know, still uses like, a, I guess, a polygon type creation, 3D rendered. You know what I mean? Very impressive versus the standard one. I just think that these trees are incredible. I wanted to show you this. I finally got around to it. I had problems getting it to work in my forge. Uh, by the way, you need forge in order to... Uh, Look at that glass too. They're glass ornaments. Ooh, those are the rare kinds. But I hope you guys enjoyed this. I'm looking forward to more from this mod maker. I want to see what he creates. I'm very excited for this. I mean, I, I hope that he can do more. I hope that he can bring more uh, to Minecraft because this truly is impressive. Anyway, that's it. Thanks for joining me on Dumb and Mods. Stay tuned. Don't forget to subscribe for more. And you can see Dumb and Dumb adventures and stuff like that. I gotta go.